Welcome to Brainstorm, where we give you a glimpse into the world of science for this Saturday, June 23, 2012. Our top story comes from the world of space exploration. A Dutch entrepreneur is leading a group with the goal of getting humans to Mars by 2023. We'll let that sink in for a second, because that's a little over a decade. Which, for a monumental endeavor like landing people on Mars, is a really short time frame. Now, this group estimates it could establish a four-person village on Mars for about six billion U.S. dollars. First, a communication satellite will be put into orbit, followed by a rover a few years later, and then supplies and living pods, and finally, the four astronauts. There is one catch. A major simplification that makes the project feasible is the fact that it's a one-way trip. That's not to say they'd never return, just that the initial mission wouldn't include a return vessel, greatly reducing the cost. Speaking of cost, I bet you're wondering where the funding is coming from. The idea is to fund this project through investors and advertisers by turning the mission into the biggest media event in the world. Now, we're going to add some opinion from this point on, and we'd love to hear yours in the comments. In the article, they discuss even making the astronaut selection like a reality show, whittling 40 contestants down to the final four astronauts. And partly, this seems to cheapen the idea of human exploration, but at the same time, it's a really good idea. Space exploration is moving more and more toward private companies. This Mars mission even has a potential supplier for every component. Rockets from SpaceX and a variety of other companies could supply current technology to make this mission possible. If turning this into a media spectacle could get it done sooner, and without any burden on taxpayers, it's hard not to get excited. Right now, they're building a strong technical case for the mission before searching for investors, but Mars colonization could happen a lot quicker than previously envisioned. And really, that story was epic enough for the whole episode, but to make up for that, we've got some updates about the new series, Biohacks. As of uploading this, fundraising is already closed and didn't go quite as planned, a little over 10% of the 1500 goal. Nevertheless, the show must go on. The focus of the show will just need some tweaking. While tutorials on procedures used in biohacking will still be featured, more of the focus will be on purely education episodes. These will help give you a foundation of knowledge for your independent biotechnology endeavors, and hopefully that will also be exciting. Thank you to all those that shared and contributed to this project. We don't have an exact start date. As always, hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please consider subscribing and be sure to check the links in the video description.